Dark Elves? The Valand army or the rebels? They're the Cadies. Why are they attacking us? No matter. Fight back. Kill anything that opposes us. Hello everyone, this is DE235 inviting commentary for Let's Play Kingdom of the Fire of the Crusaders, Regnier's Campaign. I mean, it is a pretty interesting map that I have not seen before, but you start off in the bottom, in that narrow, narrow path, and as soon as you exit it, there will be enemies that spawn. So, this mission I'm using the Swamp Mammoth, and the strategy you want to use here is to have your Swamp Mammoth go out first to attract the attention of the units and have Regnier get in, and keep your units close together. Here it is, moving. So happy that running units cannot damage each other. Otherwise, this would be really bad. But yeah. So, don't have it go out, but just have it just go past the opening, and then once the enemies spawn, have it attack, and then you attack the units. There will also be wyverns coming in, so wyverns and scorpions. Though they only seem to, though the scorpions only seem to engage in melee combat, though, so I'm not really too worried. But um, if you look at the enemy levels, they are very high level, a much higher level than Regnier. So you want to keep him healed as much as possible and keep your SP up because. He can die pretty quickly if you're not paying attention. I wonder how the Swamp Mammoth feels. I mean, all these little people are fighting around it. But anyway, yeah. Since Regnir has a fire elemental attack when he goes berserk, you can basically take out Scorpion pretty quickly. And he doesn't get hit stun. That also which is also very good. See? Yep, so that that got cleaned up pretty quickly towards the end. Now that those two units there cast magic, one of the, they cast they cast a meteor. In this particular instance, the meteor they cast missed my units both times. So, but nonetheless, don't take them any less lightly. So I just have my Swan so Matthews' it's ranged attack. I don't know what it is, but it works. If you chase after them, they just run away. Um, during this entire mission, there are no enemy archers here. So the only reason you want to go into the forest is to avoid the wyvern attacks. And if you see that if I'm constantly hitting them, my SP consistently stays high. So 
So yeah, that unit is running away. Then they turn around and fight anyway. I go in with Rick Mode just because I don't want to deal with getting the hits done by this horse rider. Yep. So I send on a scout to trigger the next wave of enemies. Then, since the next wave of enemies consists of two Wyvern units, you want to be close to the forest. And my scout kind of distracted that Wyvern unit. Okay. Yep, so there's a cavalry, and that's why I have Axel here. Here goes. Um, have Regnier go into Berserk mode to take out these Scorpions quickly. Fortunately, the cavalry unit got caught in melee, and so I was able to take them out quickly. And then I just take out these two scorpion units. Like nothing. But then more units come in. More scorpions. Okay. Alright, and the last unit is that Woodrun unit up there, up ahead. So we'll just send a scout, have it follow it. And then just have your archers take it out. Make sure to be in the forest. And this mission is over. So um thank you for watching. Rate, comment, and subscribe. This is D2 this is DE235 signing out. See you later. I have interrogated one of the Cadies. They're coming out in the open. Did they know of the ancient heart? The resonance. It's a sign that the is controlling you through the ancient heart. The knows not the true power of the heart. That resonance was a coincidence. However, Cadius is fully aware of its use and is attempting to steal it from the... The Cadius must be battling with the Polani by now. And their true purpose was to tie us up here until they took the heart. Why not? Everyone else wants it.